So next is your basic marinara sauce. Um, many recipes are game for it, and depending on what your preferences are and what you like and what you don't like is exactly what you put in. But we'll start off with the, the, the very basic sauce, which is gonna be tomatoes. That's our first thing that's going to go in. And we also need some tomato puree as well, because tomatoes are great, but uh, we wanted a really nice tomatoey flavor. So let's put a, a gunk of tomato puree in. And we'll just give that a little stir just to bring it together. I seem to be spilling everything today, don't I? All right, give that a stir. We need pepper in there. And we need a little bit of salt in there as well. We also need some garlic. Again, down to your preference. I like a bit of garlic, not a problem. Give it a stir. Yeah, a tiny bit of olive oil, just a little bit. And then we have basil, fresh basil. There we are, fresh basil. So, we take it off. Just rip it up and put it in. And what I tend to do with the basil is save some back for later. So you get like a double hit of the basil with it. There we are. Let's get our basil in. That will wilt down. We've ripped it. You can chop it. You can do whatever you wish. So we need to let this cook beforehand because uh, it'll take about 20 minutes for all the flavours to, to get together. So we'll, so what I'll do now is just put an anti-splatter on the top and we'll come back to that. 